Number one, how much faster does student B read than student A? So for student A, you can see we're going up by ones. And then across the bottom, we are going up by 150. It says student A reads 150 words per minute, student B reads 158 words per minute. So how much faster? I'm going to subtract 158 minus 150, and I would get 8. Student B reads 8 words per minute faster. Number two, the graph shows the rate at which student C reads. Explain how to find the reading rate for student C from the graph. You need to write down the points that you can read clearly. 1 and 140, 2 and 280, 3 and 420, and you can see how much you're changing by. We're going up by 1s. 140 to 280 is going up by 140, and so You find how much it changes by. In this case, that student reads 140 words per minute. List the three students and their reading rates in order from fastest reader to slowest reader. So the fastest reader is student B at 158, and then student A at 150, and then student C at 140. Number four, the price of strawberries at fine foods is shown in the graph. At best market, the price for y pounds of, for x pounds of strawberries is given by y equals 2.9x. Which store sells strawberries at a higher unit price? How much more will you pay for six pounds of strawberries at that store than the other store? So, I know best market is 2.9. For fine foods, I write down the points I can read clearly, 2 and 1 and 3 and 6. 1 to 3 is going up 2. 2 to 6 is going up 4. I write my slope, y over x, in this case 4 over 2, which is 2. Best market... is higher. The second question asks, how much more will you pay for six pounds of strawberries at that store than the other store? So, at best market, six pounds is going to be 2.9 times six, which is 17.4. And at fine foods, it would be two times six, which is 12. So 17.4 minus 12 gives me a difference of 5.4. Uh, $5 and 40 cents difference. Find how much they cost for six pounds and then subtract. Number five, the price Y for X pounds of nails that you fix it is represented by Y equals 4.4X. The unit price for the same type of nails at Just Hardware is 30 cents per pound greater than the unit price that you fix it. Complete the table to show the cost for one, two, three, four pounds of nails at Just Hardware. So, I take the 4.4 and I add the .30 to it and I get 4.70. That's per pound. So, one pound is 4.70. 470 times 2 is going to give us 940. 470 times 3 gives us 14.10. And 470 times 4 gives us 18.80. Number 6. The table of the equation shows the approximate speeds for a roadrunner and a coyote running at top speed. Which animal runs faster? How much faster per minute? So... 1 to 2 to 3 to 4 is going up 1. 29 to 58 to 87 to 116 is going up by 29. 
y over x is going to give us 29 over 1, which is 29 feet per second. The coyote runs 0.7 miles per minute. Now, we need to convert them so they are in the same units, feet and miles, and the same time, seconds and minutes. So, if it's 29 feet per second, I multiply 29 times 60 because there's 60 seconds in a minute. That gives me 1,740 feet per minute. I am then going to divide that by 5,280 because that's how many feet are in a mile. So 1,740 divided by 5,280 is going to be, it's a big long decimal, it's going to be about 0.33 miles per minute. So the coyote runs 0.7 miles per minute, the roadrunner runs 0.33 miles per minute. So the coyote runs faster. It then says how much faster, so I'm going to subtract 0.70 minus 0.33 and that's going to give us 0.37 miles per minute faster.